Hi everyone, there's a lot going on in Washington right now and we're all hearing about the fiscal cliff and the charitable tax deduction. And on our website we've got, uh, you'll find some great resources to help you figure this out. I just want to spend a few moments today to share with you a couple of very important facts. First of all, thank you for being charitable givers. It's really important to know that in the month of December, 20% of all the charitable giving takes place. And the nonprofit sector, all of our communities benefit from your philanthropy, from all of our philanthropy that takes place in Michigan. As we've been working with Washington and working with our congressional delegation, the message we've been trying to point out is that the nonprofit sector and charitable giving are such an important part of our society, of our communities, we can't afford to limit the charitable deduction or put a cap on it. It would, frankly, it would result in a loss of jobs. So while I speak about jobs, we just recently, in partnership with the Michigan Nonprofit Association, had public sector consultants do an updated economic analysis. And it's important to note that one of every 10 Michiganders works for a nonprofit organization. It's 435,000 jobs, and indirectly there's another quarter of a million jobs. So we're an important part of Michigan's economy. And when we're talking with our members of Congress and they get this message, we need to remind them that when they're thinking about nonprofits and the charitable tax deduction, they also need to be thinking about jobs for Michiganders. So that's the first important message. The second is, we learned when we were in Washington last week, meeting with members of Congress and meeting with our congressional delegation, that the United Way has just done a national poll. And it's important to note that in this poll, and it's going to be available in a wonderful infographic called Charitable Giving in America on our website, you can download it, that 79% of donors across the country said that if the charitable deduction is limited or capped, that it is going to impact charitable giving. So Americans really value the charitable tax deduction as a partnership between government and our individuals, and one that not just benefits the individual, it benefits our communities. It's all about, frankly, building communities. So I want you to know that we're um, working actively to make sure that our members of Congress understand the value of the charitable tax deduction. If you see members of Congress during this holiday break, which we think they will get a holiday break from Washington, um, remind them that this is an important part of our culture. And, you know, CMF, the Council of Michigan Foundations, on your behalf, is really privileged to host visitors from all over the world who come to us because they hear about philanthropy in Michigan, they hear about philanthropy in America, and they recognize the fact that we are in a, an important partnership here. And so the charitable tax deduction in, in the United States has had an impact on charitable giving and changes in government law in South Africa, in Russia, in Eastern Europe, in Asia, across the world. So let's all celebrate giving in the month of December and make sure our legislators understand the value of the charitable tax deduction. Thank you so much. Visit our website for these great resources and we'll keep you posted as the story unfolds in Washington.